Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new. My name is Tam and in today's video I'm going to be showing you how to get this makeup look. I recently purchased the Urban Decay Naked Honey palette and I am so obsessed with it. Firstly, I'm going to be taking my Maybelline Baby Skin and this is the product that I'm going to be using to prime my face. Next, I'm going to be taking the MAC Studio Fix Fluid Foundation. I'm in the shade NC20, in case you were wondering. I'm then going to take my Beauty Blender from Real Techniques and just apply that all over my face. I'm then going to be taking my Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Concealer and I'm just going to be putting that underneath my eyes, covering up my pimples and then just around the edges of my nose. I'm then blending that out with my Beauty Blender. I'm then taking this Estee Lauder Loose Setting Powder. And I'm just setting basically underneath my eyes and wherever I applied the concealer. I'm then taking my Benefit Cabral and I'm just gonna draw a line underneath my eyebrow. And then I'm gonna just blend that out with a spoolie. And repeat on the other side. Now for this gorgeous baby. So I'm first gonna be taking the honey shade from the Naked Honey palette. And I'm just gonna be using that as my base shade. And I'm just blending that out from the outer edge into my crease. I'm then gonna be taking the shade Keeper and doing the same thing that I did with the honey. Just keep blending the two together. I'm then taking a more fluffier brush just to blend it out even smoother. I'm then taking the shade Drip, which is the second darkest shade of the palette. And I'm just gonna be applying that into the outer edge of my eye as well and just blending it into the other two colors. I'm then going to be taking the darkest shade of this palette, which is Ding, and just patting that on into the outer edge of my eye, trying to keep it mainly on the outer edge of the lid, and then just blending that out into the previous colors with that big fluffy brush. I'm then going to be taking the shade Keeper again and just applying that again to the outer edge just to give it a little bit more of a pigment as I'm just trying to build up these colors. I'm then going to be taking the lightest shade called Flyby and I'm going to just apply this to my brow bone and the inner corners of my eyes. I'm 
I'm then going to be taking the shade Amber and just packing that onto my lid. Just with the flatter end of the Naked Honey brush. And then just blending it out. I'm then adding some pigment to the bottom of my eyes. So I'm taking the shade Keeper and I'm just applying that to the underneath of my eye just to give that smoky look. I'm then going to be taking my Yardley Raincoat Mascara. This is the clear mascara that I use for my eyebrows to keep them in place all day. I'm then taking a spoolie just to brush out the excess product. I'm now going to curl my lashes. My eyelash curler is from MAC. I'm then going to be taking this Estee Lauder brown eyeliner. And I really, really love this eyeliner, especially that it is brown. It is not so harsh as a black, but it is quite smoky and works so perfectly with this palette. I'm going to be taking my Clinique mascara and applying that to my lashes. Drunk to the bone when I met you. I don't give a fuck with the next dude. I don't really see no issues with it. Just one of those nights when you want my back. I'm then gonna be taking my hula bronzer and just contouring my face with this bronzer and this big fluffy brush. I'm then going to just lightly contour my nose as well. Then I'm just going to blend that out with my fingertip just so it's not so harsh. And then also applying bronzer to the bottom lip as this gives a more poutier look. And then taking my Maybelline Face Studio strobing stick and I really really love this highlighting stick. I'm applying that to my cheekbones, the tip of my nose, my cupid's bow, my chin and my forehead and then just blending that out with my beauty blender. I'm then going to be taking my MAC lipstick. This is my favourite lipstick. I have been obsessed with this lipstick since 2016. It is in the shade Velvet Teddy. And there you have it guys. This is the final makeup look. I hope you enjoyed. It's pretty simple. This is my kind of glam makeup. So I really hope you enjoyed this. Please leave a like and comment down below if you enjoyed this makeup look. If you'd want me to do more of these videos and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I love you all so so much and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.